Hello folks, this is Scott with Dallas Paint Correction and Auto Detailing. This is going to be a very difficult review for me because every time I use this pad, I get the serious giggles. Folks, I know we like our foam pads. I know we like our long throw polishers. I know we like our microfiber cutting pads when we're going after deep defects. Folks, I wish all of you, even some of my, my more advanced viewers on my channel, if you've never used a rotary before, I, 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 I want to make an analogy here. I wish everybody had to, dr had to learn how to drive with a standard transmission before they could buy an automatic vehicle. It's just my opinion. What I'm going to do right now on this long throw polisher, it's the Sherhold long throw polisher 21 millimeter. I have the Rupez. This is the medium cut wool pad. When I touch this thing, all I want to do is laugh. Folks, Rupez, I have teased them about their machines. I have teased them about their stalling. Folks, this pad is one of the greatest pads you will ever use. What happens when you're using, this is, I, I hope I don't lose you guys, but when you're using a foam pad with a compound, a polish, there's so much that's lost between the user having that attached to a DA this is the hardest thing for me to be, I could never teach this. This just comes with time. This comes with experience. I can feel, and I know you're going to get whacked out and you're going to go, Scott, you're full of crap. But I can feel the space between the pad and the paint. This is the sweet spot of knowledge when it comes to paint correction. You kind of lose all of that when you're using a foam pad with any type of dual action polisher. Doesn't mean they don't give you great results, but if you've ever used a rotary, what will happen, it's like, it's like making love to the paint. I know that sounds so silly, I'm about ready to crack up myself, but there is a totally different experience when you're using wool to cut paint. Somebody's going to ask me, Scott, I'm a little scared. Wool, it means holograms. It means all this crazy stuff, burning paint. I want you to get that out of your head if you're a more advanced user or a more advanced paint correction specialist, whatever you want to call it. A lot of you guys like using microfiber cutting discs. These are great. These will go after serious deep deep defects but what happens is they get the paint too hot they also can leave the paint very hazy and then you got a second step right you got to polish out here's something to think about guys even if the microfiber can go after serious deep defects and you've got all that haze on the paint and you go oop I want to polish out and I'll be fine you have to remember something the finer or the clearer or the less hazy you can finish out on your first step your second step is going to be far easier and your second step is going to bring you so much more clarity it's really really important on your first step even using an aggressive pad and an aggressive compound you want to finish out as well as you can because that's ultimately going to give you shine and gloss on your second step folks I'm just going to use this Rupes medium wool pad and I'm probably going to get giggly as can be I have a, tr a junk trashed hood here don't even don't even look at the defects I'll never get these defects out unless I remove the clear coat completely I want to show you the experience the, the idea of using like a foam pad, you know the one inch per second to be able to polish paint, remove defects? Aren't you tired of that? Or don't you just want to get to the punch? Don't you want to feel like you're making love to the paint and watch it just kind of talk to you? Don't you want to feel the experience between the pad and the paint? I know it's crazy, guys, stay with me. But I'll show you how I use this thing. I don't know how much I can teach through this moment here, but watch my arm speeds, watch me get giggly, watch me get, I feel like I'm coming home. I feel like I'm coming back to the rotary even though I'm using a dual action polisher. I'm just going to be using a finish polish by Rupes. What I'm going to do is put a little bit on this paint, right? Some of you are going, oh my god, that's way too much. I'm just going to go in here, get this product onto the pad, right? Watch my arm speed throughout this process, folks. This is making love to the paint. This is restoring shining gloss. This is removing light defects at such a fast rate. And also the other issue here is it will be much more easier on me. No pushing down on the, on the DA polisher. No one inch per second. It's a much more enjoyable experience. Here we go.
get it, let's keep going. When you're actually doing something that's fun, you can't stop. You just want to keep moving the polisher along. I'll put some more over here. I'll get that in a minute. Go in here, get this stuff up. Holy crap, Rupez, I'm falling in love with you again. I won't buy one of your machines, but you have created one of the best pads. It's so much easier on the body. It's so much more enjoyable to do paint correction, polish paint. It's like I can't stop laughing. It's like going home with years of using the rotary. Go in here, buff out this polish. And the shining gloss that's on this paint, I know you guys can't pick it up on the camera, is 10 times more clear, more crisp than any foam pad could ever, ever give me. What I would love you guys to do, for some of you guys going, oh, I'm afraid of wool. I'm afraid of making holograms. Well, holograms that show up on paint with a rotary are far different than what you'll experience with this type of wool pad. This wool pad here, it's made for a DA. Whether it's fixed rotation or long throw, the wool is quite different. When you're using a rotary at high speeds, you're gonna create holograms. Folks, this stuff, hard paint, medium paint, it is amazing. I wish I could bring you in, you really won't see any difference here, but the shining gloss just ramped up by two or three, two or three levels just by going quickly over this paint. Rupez, I won't buy your machines, but I'm absolutely in love with you. One of the greatest pads I have ever used. You can use this with a, an aggressive compound and one step of a vehicle that's got hard clear coat You'll step back and go, holy crap, I got the defects off the paint. I restored tremendous shining gloss. I'm done, folks. This is just, I mean, it gets to the point where I can't stop using it, right? Let me pick up this polish again. I'll go in here and just enjoy the experience. This is like, this is like being 14 years old and you found your best friend and you can't stop playing with it. Folks, this is tremendous. It's just a great experience. I can't stop playing with this stuff. It's amazing. You're gonna love it. All the angel wax boys that tell you, you gotta do one inch per second, low arm speeds. Forget it. Get in here, have fun. Learn how to polish the car. Have fun. No more sitting here one inch per second wasting your time. Enjoy the experience. Make love to this paint. Oh my goodness gracious, I feel like I've gone home. I feel like I've got a rotary in my hand once again and I truly can get nice shiny gloss, amazing clarity on paint. Folks, I'm not impressed with this polish, right? It seems like it takes forever to buff it off, but guess what? We're not gonna beat up Rupes too bad with this. This machine, or this pad, is freaking amazing. Every time I play with it, 
I can't stop giggling. I can't stop laughing. Very easy to clean versus a microfiber pad. If you've got some air or something like that, blow it out. A little brush, it will release compound. The spent clear coat off the pad so much quicker. It's such a great experience. You're not gonna hurt anything. Get, hit, get in here, make love to your paint, feel the experience, have some fun. Man, I want all of you guys to get a test hood. I want you to get a wool pad. I want you to use the long throw polisher of choice. Rupes, amazing. Absolutely love you once again. I will be buying many of these pads. These pads are unbelievable. I've been testing this one for weeks. It holds up, no pressure, no more one inch per second. You want tremendous shiny gloss, you wanna get it quickly, you wanna have fun doing it. Folks, Rupes has hit a home run.